All right, everyone. It is me, Johnson Chan, and hopefully everyone had a very good uh, weekend. I know I took Friday off as well. Uh, so it's been a it's been a pretty hell of a week last week, right? With all the crazy, you know, downward action mostly, right? I can't really think of any situation where something went up. Uh, and actually, the only thing that did go up apparently was. Orca Protocol and this new Titano fork that we'll cover at the end of the, today, which is um, Lock Pay or something like that. So, yeah, so it's pretty good. And I actually bought that and I'll be adding that to the playlist as well. So, so yeah. So, anyway, I've just been fuming over the Sphere chart and uh, it was actually getting kind of problematic because crypto was actually going up slowly over the weekend. All right, Bitcoin's now at like 30,600, 500. Yeah, it's fluctuating a bit, but yeah, like Greg Manorino has been saying, you know, you got to watch the debt market and yeah, cash is leaving the debt market and going into stocks and cryptocurrencies. It's actually at a healthy, very healthy pace as well. So, you know, it's going to be, it's going to be a good day today. All right. It's, it's already 7.34 a.m. I actually woke up at six, but I wanted to play my games and then, you know, um, you know, move money, well, not really move money around, but I've been playing a lot of the rocket science. That thing is actually probably already going to out, I think it's already about outperforming or matching my sphere uh, position. That's how badly sphere's been doing, all right, which is still making a lot of money by most people's standards, but I mean, it's nowhere near what it used to make. So, I don't know. It's like, uh, it, it's getting to the point where for sphere, like, I don't know what the problem is. Like, there's just way too much dumping pressure on. Everything else is going up except Sphere. Now, I'm starting to see that maybe turn around. So, today's going to be pretty important. But in the next couple of days, I'm actually going to, like, dump all my Sphere and, like, remove it from the playlist. If everything's going up and not Sphere, then we've got a problem. All right? And I actually looked, finally, at Dystopia or Penrose. I always get the... This is a thing that's live now. I actually looked at the TVL. It's actually not that much. It's, like, what, $300,000, $400,000? Right, I mean that's part of the problem with using such a, a niche blockchain. There's not a lot of money in there, so. Uh, but I mean, it is what it is. So we'll we'll see what happens. And obviously, this whole curve thing obviously is not what it's cracked up to be. You know, because if it were if it were really that good, I mean, everybody that would be using it would be making a lot of money, and that's just not the case. You know, you're better off just being on Binance Smart Chain. Oh, oh well. Uh, well, we'll see what happens. But anyway, uh, I took um, so you know right now for now I'm just gonna go stick with YouTube sources. I actually don't really feel like making too many videos, mostly because I just want good projects, right, and not you know crap projects. Uh, and I thought I'm feeling a little physically lazy because now I'm focusing a lot more on managing my actual crypto positions. So, you know, there's really not much incentive for us to really go over, like, shit projects, essentially, right? But at least when we do cover something, we I'm hoping it'll be higher quality, you know? So, all right. So this one is called Chicken Land, or whatever it is, app.chicken. So basically, it's your typical miner. It does have a kind of, you know, pretty huge tax gap, right? It's only 2% fee. But 9% return, so that's 7%. It's not really the great. It's not great, but let me see. This 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 doesn't this doesn't uh, whatever. Yeah, sell eggs every seven days. All right. So basically, this is supposed to be a, a an auto compounding miner. So it's obviously just a miner, but it'll automatically compound it for you. So this is kind of an interesting concept. So as is typical with every miner, you get diluted. Um, all right, unless there's also, there's you can point to the contract code and like you you're a, you're uh, able to contradict other commenters from other YouTubers. You know you have to assume there's dilution in any of these projects, right? At least any of these miner type projects, right? So you can actually uh, have this thing automatically compound for you. I don't know when it auto compounds, right? Uh, let's see, but you can have it so that at least it'll just sell at once every whatever it is. And yeah, I, I'm not planning to use this, obviously, but if I were to use it, 
I would probably just sell eggs like every one or two days. I mean, I don't know if this thing will accept decimals, right? Because, because again, the tax gap's too big. Um, I don't know what the drink. Do I have? Is this thing actually live? Oh, I gotta log in my dummy MetaMask. Hold on. Okay, there we go. Yeah. All right. So it doesn't have a lot of TVL in there, but I mean, it is better than like a project that just you know didn't whatever and this did show up on a youtube store so they're obviously paying for some kind of marketing uh but again i actually just want there's a reason why i'm not putting rocket science on the playlist even though it's been doing really well all right because i think the devs of that particular project do not actually want aggressive marketing so that's why i'm not putting on the playlist i actually want projects like rocket science though because that thing really is outperforming everyone you know, because I believe in the Elite Discord, it was referred to as a staker project. I don't know. Well, we need, like, more of those, right? I, like, yeah. Because um, yeah. I'm cause I'm already making far more money off of that. I mean, it makes more money than all my mining projects combined, right? I mean, it even makes far more than my BNB miner. And I put a lot in the BNB miner. So it's like, you know, <laughs> yeah. But anyway, I do want to keep today's video short because I need to get back to watching the markets, playing with Twitter, probably play some games too, and really just relax. Because there's just too much to go. And on top of that, I just want to look at what's happening with Sphere because if I'm, if I'm really going to exit Sphere, I'm going to need like a lot of data to work with. So, so I want to be sure. Because obviously I don't want to dump my Sphere. But I mean, I don't know. Like Titanal is already going back up too. So I mean, how can you... Like, it just doesn't make sense. It's like, it's actually kind of pissing me off. Like, this is like, what's going on? And yeah, I already know what the problem with Sphere is. There's too much dumping pressure. And the, and that so-called auto liquidity engine is actually causing too much dumping pressure too. Because every time there's like a, a, a nice big buy, the liquidity engine immediately dumps on everyone. I, I, haven't, <coughs> I haven't said anything in their Sphere Discord, but I might actually bring it up. And just like... Can we put it to a vote? Can we like pause or significantly slow down the stupid uh, liquidity engine? Because it's just like it's because it, it literally dumps one to two million sphere. It's like you, you can't you can't win. You can't win. All right. Everyone's making money right now. Every project's going up right now. All right. Binance Coin's already back at three hundred thirty-two dollars. All right. Only Sphere is now lagging behind. Like that. There's no excuse for that. So it, it, it's really pissing me off. But you know whatever. So anyway, check out chickenland.io. Uh, I guess uh, I mean there is, it's a, it's an all right uh, it's an all right amount of BNB TVL, and of course you can play with this uh, sell eggs everything. Now the thing is, I don't know if you can change this once you put this in. I think you should be able to, all right. But again, it's up to you to decide how you want to you know play this project if you want to play it. So. Like, subscribe, share this video around. Uh, thank you again to all the new and old people watching this channel. So keep telling everyone about this uh, place, this YouTube, so it could keep growing the channel. And I will see you in the next project, which is uh, Honey Brew Finance. I've been seeing this a lot, so hopefully, uh, you know, so that should be a good one. Because that one's actually kind of an interesting take on minor projects, so we'll talk about it then. All right. Thanks for watching. See you next video. Wait, this microphone was on. Right? <laughs> I got it. It's like, uh, I, uh, man, yeah, the microphone's on. Okay, good.